All right. This is the uh, MKH Mortal Kombat Hour. I'm your host, Baby Juelas, with my uh, with my one time guest. Yeah, I'm only gonna be here once. Uh, Joel, I'm here to critique Jules's gaming style and uh, tell him what he's doing wrong and tell him what's going on in the world. I fucking know anything. All right. Well, uh, I guess uh, I guess we'll start. All right. So, Jules, basically, what you're gonna do is play the first three games and beat each game with every single character. Yes, I'm gonna be playing a fan favorite. Uh, no Sonya. one likes Sonya. Sonya's a '90s mom. She is a brave '90s mom who entered the tournament. She was in her minivan to get some. She was in her minivan. I don't know. Driving to to soccer practice with her two boys, Donald and 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 Reagan, and she was gonna drop them off. And then this teleport thing warped her back into this weird universe where she has to fight to the death. That's what Sonya's backstory is. Alright, she's just a freaking soccer mom from the 90s. And she's like, oh geez, I better kill these guys so I can get home in time to cook dinner. What's a girl gotta do around here to get some lunch for her kids? <laughs> What's a girl gotta do to get some carrot sticks? What's a mom? Damn it! Messed up the fatality. Fa messed up the fatality. Negative 5,000 points. Moving on to Kano. See... On that previous screen, you could see that it was two Kano, but if you look up at his health bar, it looks like Kanu, because uh, whoever invented this game wasn't considering the yellow outline of the health box, so it looks like Sunya and Kanu. That's my main complaint with this game. Ooh, that was a nice counter there. Finished off with a jump kick, classic Sunya move. Yeah. Or Sunya, because you can't fucking see that. It's an O. Sunya. Well, that's kind of how the narrator says it, actually. Yeah. Hey, Jules, in Star Trek the original series, was there any... Was Ohara the only black lady, or did they have more black people? They had black people. I don't remember usually, ever seeing It a would black usually person. be for a romantic interest of Ohara. Really? Mm hmm I never remember her hitting uh, on black Well, it, it happened on I mean, one. she hit on Spock, she hit on, uh, JT Kirk. On, uh, it happened they on They kissed. One they kissed. Yeah, it's kind of famous. It's kind of famous. <laughs> That time I did not mess up the fatality, and Kanu is torched. <laughs> yeah, Sonya's ending, you know, her like fatality is probably the dorkiest one out there. It's literally just because she's a girl, they made her uh, blow a fiery kiss. I don't know. Are you gonna be excited when you fight Raiden? I mean, when you play as Raiden. My bad, you're fighting him right now. Well, I guess so. I'll be pretty happy. Be pretty happy to finally get to spin the, the circle. I don't know. No, that's great. He got you there. He, he's actually a pretty pervert. His face was in your pelvis he's area. He's a pretty pervert. He's a pretty pervert. <laughs> no, he looks like a crazy man. Actually, isn't the guy who play him the guy who plays as his character is actually Hispanic, right? Uh, I don't know. We're on the credits. He had like his a name. he had a Hispanic. -like I think his last name was Pacino. <laughs> or Pacino. Yeah. Well, it looks like Sonya beat him after all, got the fatality. Sonya wins. Classic Sonya move. Ah, oh, I broke the wood. That's good. Broke the wood? Oh, yeah. That's How often do you break the anvil? Uh, very rarely. It's, uh, it's, it's a challenge to break the anvil. Yeah. I think, uh, no one can do it, except me. Jules, uh, what's a, what's a dumb animal? An animal that you think is just dumb? Uh, a koala. A koala? I want them to die. Well, if there was a koala hanging on a bridge, koala. I wouldn't help him. I'd push him off. <laughs> he would slowly pry off his little koala fingers one by one until yeah. he falls to his death. And first I'd inspect the, inspect is everything under the bridge. Is there water under the bridge, or is it just... I it? hope not. If there is, I'm gonna... Well, can a koala swim? <laughs> can, can, can koala oh, swim? Sure, I sure know. Tyler, can koala swim? Oh, yeah, Tyler is uh, here as well, Coco Cat Lord himself. Tyler, That's why we're on his, his stream. Picard looks like he's in some deep shit. What are you trying to say? Tyler PR. Oh. He's Tyler PR. That was a fail. Yeah, well, uh, whatever. I don't think they can. I think they uh, like climbing trees. Yeah, well, uh, hopefully, because... You know their leaves are poison. The leaves they eat are poisonous, right? Uh, koalas drown in swimming pools when they are looking for water to drink. <laughs> 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 Stupid animal! 
Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's if they aren't, if there are no assisted ways for a koala to climb out, they will eventually drown. Most, yes. most pools have little ladders. And if it doesn't have a ladder, it has steps. My pool won't. Jeez. <laughs> Your pool won't have steps or a ladder. It'll just be this deep hole in the ground that says, Come here, koalas. <laughs> put, out, oh, yeah. put out their little poisonous leaves. They don't even know how to eat properly. Scorpion, I think, is really gonna... He's getting you every single time with his harpoon. Yeah, he's, uh... Facebook. On Facebook? Yeah. What the heck is this? Here. Huh? What? Oh. Oh, uh... Well, ask and, and Twitch, you, 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 you boy. Uh, I'm a butt man. I like butts. I like big booty and I, I can't lie. Hey, what's, what's going on? Why are we talking about butts now? Hey, Ian, well, one, Ian, uh, whatever the fuck his name is, he uh, he asked uh, if you like boobs or butt, which is just a basic question that I've been asked many times, and I just, you know, I'm a butt guy. But Scorpion's gonna rape you. He raped me. Yeah, ever since I've been playing Asanya, I've been viewing these all in uh, rape scenarios. Because really? Because helpless woman. Why would you say that? Because it's true. Well, uh... Fuck this Asian rice man. Ugh. What do you think about boobs, Jules? Well, uh, they're nice. They're nice to look at, I guess. You know, boobs a boob. But, uh, would you eat a barbecue dinner off a pair of them? Sure, why not? Slather some barbecue sauce on that? Any sane man would. <laughs> <laughs> I actually wouldn't. Like, I've never been into the whole eating things off of people. I always got it like a cringe. Like a, a nauseous feeling. Yeah, it'd be weird. It would be pretty awkward. You know, like when guys dip their uh, wieners in chocolate fountains and girls suck all the chocolate off. I'm just like, gross. Yeah. Or vice versa. Like when a lady blows a bunch of whipping cream down below. That just sounds gross to me too. I'm like, I would like some whipping cream, but not off your fishy vagina. Oh. We're watching uh, Star Wars. Uh, season Trek. Season 2, Next Generation. With, uh, Catherine Picard. He's French, but you know, I don't hate him. I don't, you know, Jules, when you watch a show for a really Oh, yeah, Joel, long. what animal do you hate? You never, you never oh, answered that. Uh, I answered koalas. Well, well, you, you never explained them. why you hate them. Yeah, I did. They're useless animals. They pee in people's soda and they suck. What? They pee in soda? Yeah! Says who? You, in Has it happened to you? <laughs> you know, someone peed in your soda? The koala snuck up to your can of coke? Uh, no, but, uh, there's many helpless people in Australia who have to deal with that every day, and I'm sorry, but I'm not, I'm not a selfish man, I feel their pain, I think, uh, who, um, let me put it this way, koalas are endangered, I think, if we're already on the right track, let's just finish the job. Finish the job? Yeah. Get a Hitler for koalas? Do you think we would try to say anything about Hitler? Do you think, uh, if there was a Hitler who was anti-koala, do you think the world would have tried to stop him like they did? You know, the normal Hitler? No, no one cares about, well, Since people do care about koalas, so, uh, which makes them mad. If you saw a little girl with a koala, I love koala t-shirt, would you spit on her? Yeah, yeah. Well, I'd say, hey, little girl, uh, fuck you. <laughs> you don't explain why. Oh, Sub-Zero. Yeah, he's, uh, he's really, he's really cornering me and, uh, beating me down the bush, beating me around the bush. Beating me around the... Ah, since we're talking about Australia. Anyways, you're... I, I think a dumb animal out there... Hmm. I think hipp hippopotamuses are pretty dumb. They're just, they're just uh, mud aqua pigs. Like they're aqua pigs and they they fight people. They fight people. They're more dangerous than uh, zebras and lions. Uh, yeah. Well, no more people get killed by them than uh. I mean, uh, some, 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 poor, some poor guy is trying to fish, yeah. mind his own business, and this big hippo fucking pumps his boat until he dies. Yeah. Wow, that was a nice little exchange of range attacks there. Is this your second attempt at Sub Zero? Or third? It's like third or something. He's really on the aggressive side. And uh, you're missing a couple of your kicks, but you're blocking most of it. That's very impressive. Your block's pretty good. Ooh, tried to finish him with the leg grab. I think the Leg grab is probably the most awkward move. Even Raiden's pelvis grab is better than that. Yeah. Raiden's pelvis grab? What are you talking about? You know, when he does his <laughs> charges, flies there, he grabs oh, yeah. your pelvis and his little pl He plunges your his head into your vagina. He stabs you with his pointy hat. And screams and <laughs> grows you up from the inside. <laughs> 
He that screams and shoots dog. lightning out of his wiener. Anyways, dudes, you know when you watch a show for a long time, all the female characters on the show you never look, would look twice for, but when you watch a show long enough, you slowly get attracted to them? Yeah, like uh, that one lady from Tortor, I can't remember her name. The thing was like Gwen. Dude, oh yeah, Gwen. Oh, Gwen was fucking hot. I know, yeah, but the first few episodes, I was like, uh, I was like, I yeah, look, she's alright. twice. But, uh, after watching the show, I... I realized it was a different story. Just, it's just Ian, Jules. It's just Ian saying stupid Jesus, stuff. Jesus, Ian, shut up! Shut up, Ian. Oh, I forgot to tell Harlan that uh, Harlan is already here. Mm, 90s mom for the power. My engineers have examined it. Oh, Merrimack. Oh! That's, uh, Who's that's gonna, actually not rare Red Sonya's gonna win. She's clearly more wise. She's punching you. You're jumping. You're, you're getting your header. She just did a double whammy on you and tried to finish you off with the range. I think uh, the lore for the Red Sonya is pretty much open. Um... If any, uh, if anyone wants to make up some lore for Sonya, go No, not there. make up any. I want an official Mortal Kombat lore. Well, the lore, the lore for, uh, Sonya is that she's on a military mission or something like that. She's like a soldier. Can't you well, tell I know, from I know her, that. From her uniform? Huh? No, she's American. She's American. When you beat the game, it shows American flag behind her. It's pretty cool. Oh. Tyler's, uh, Tyler's battling about Russian <laughs> 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 Oh, ah, that's perfectly fine. I mean, you're technically editor man. You're computer boy. You got all the monitors. He's Tyler PR. Yeah, he is PR. Tyler is PR. Tyler PR. PR. It's really nice when you and Warren are together. It's something more special. Bibles aren't allowed in schools anymore, Jules. Damn it! Sneaking your Bible in school, the principal's gonna stab you. I always, uh, I always remember back to my youth in school how I tried to sneak in Bibles past the principal. Yeah, me too. Whole life. I'd sneak it in. I'd be like, "Hey kids, you want some Bibles?" And then, uh, cop be like, "Mom, me mommy said like, that's not no." And then uh, I got all scared. Yeah. I'd dish them out. And I dish them out in the alleyway out, out back. Yeah, smoke some cigs. Ooh, I'm on the endurance matches now. Very hot. Uh, you know, actually, uh, Jules, you're not. You, you like white girls. I do. Except, uh, you know, you're racist. <laughs> well, it depends. You know, I like, I like some. Uh, I like, I, I eventually like girls of any uh, race. What know, such ethnicity? As Chanel, my girlfriend. Her from uh, Doctor Who. Oh my gosh, it's a great show. Ooh. Whoa! It's a great show. It has space. Yeah. Um, actually, I what was her name? The the nurse. Yeah. The nurse. Uh, I can't remember, but she what? was real hot. She was fucking hot. Tyler nods. <laughs> Tyler nodded. You Just like sleep. yeah. You're probably the hottest. No, the new one's pretty hot if you like redheads. Yeah, uh, Amy. I think she has more cute than than hotness. Though. Uh, I did not like Rose. Rose was, I didn't like she Rose. She has a monkey face, and she'd cry a lot, and I didn't like her. Did she have like a little beauty mark here too? I'm not into the beauty mark. Before. I think she had like a freckle or a mole. A big fat mole, big fat hairs hanging out of it. <clears throat> Actually got one of those on my arm. Could be skin cancer. Though. I don't. But uh, I'm just kidding. Jules, have you ever seen like a, a, a porno where the guy has like freckles all over his wiener? Little moles? <laughs> In orbit around a planet, and Ooh, to Mark hear about those? Uh, yeah, yeah. this, uh, this, this, this Remember that, uh, Ras, stars, remember like, that uh, Russian old yeah, crazy dude, Rasputin? Rasputin! Yeah. Apparently, I was reading, uh, a history book about him, and apparently, he has, uh, it was weird, he was like this crazy priest guy, but he was real popular with the ladies, and rumors had it, he was so successful with the ladies, because he had a, uh, a, a, a wart at the tip of his wiener, which hit the G-spot, it was a big fat wart. That's kind of why it's so famous in Russia. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I do not have a wart. Wait. Oh, yeah. Remember the Doctor Who episode where they were on the moon? The whole, the whole dang hospital was on the moon. Yeah. That was the first episode featuring Hot Black Girl. Yep. What'd you think? I can't even remember what that episode was about. 
besides Pippa the Long Moon. Welcome, Sam. Hey, Sam, how's it going? How are the wife and kids? Do you have wife and kids? Uh, we would like to know that. I would like to know what their names are and where you live. <laughs> How many? Heights? Weights? Heights? Weights? Uh, race? What, what are we talking about? Tell us a, bit, a little bit about yourself, Sam. What kind of kids? Yeah, let's focus on the kids. No, fuck that. That's messed up. I don't care about your kids, Sam. I do. Jules, hurry up and beat Sonya so you can learn the magic of Raiden. Wait, what endurance match is this? The first or second? This is the first. And after this, man, I need to fight some other. There's no way you're gonna be able to fight a whole other guy. See, you just got hit in the head. That's a problem. Like, uh, Raiden's gonna kill you right now. Right now. Mm, just fucking kills you. He shoots his little lightning storm. Wow, real impressive, Raiden. Well, guess what? You just wasted your energy. Now I'm going to kill you. Uh, do you think Raiden has full control over his electricity, or like sometimes he'll accidentally like uh, well, that's like, uh, like you know, premature ej ejaculation type thing? Or he's yeah, like lightning. <gasps> Genital related. Little like, like squirts out. Yeah, like you know when you get scared, you might like do. Oh, you know, like instead of ah! doing. Oh, you should ah! it out of it. Yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. Ah! Shit. You commie piece of shit. Dang, this guy's just. Uh, Dude, you're done. Oh! What's up? Hey, Joel, what's up with Wesley? He's uh, talking to Captain Bacar about handling things. Can you... These, Wesley's turning into a man. We yeah, we season know, two? We know Dude, how that is. You know how buffed Wesley's gonna be by season fucking seven? He's gonna be a Captain, uh, Captain Kirk, but in a man. man Captain body. Kirk wasn't even buff. He was like weird, fat, six, can't tell 60s man. Hey, what? Captain Kirk wasn't buff. He was can't tell what you are, 60s man. You know? Where yeah. They, like suck it all in. You could tell you was sucking it in. I really want to picture. Especially when a when a when a female uh, would walk in the room, like, just <laughs> suck it in immediately. We're <laughs> we're uh, <laughs> we were talking about the uh, holodeck. Like what it would look like if <laughs> you just saw the holodeck empty. Yeah. <laughs> Riker. <laughs> <laughs> Huh? Oh yeah, that's uh, oh, yeah, after dark. After dark. Uh, we were playing Dungeons and Dragons, and we were planning on doing like a like little pod podcast kind of thing. Uh, you know, late at night. We were playing Dungeons and Dragons. We started talking about Gary and Coleman. Jules and I just started talking about Gary Coleman, and then everyone joined in the conversation. And next thing we know, we got like two hours of talking. It was pretty fun. So we might do another one tonight. So if you like Gary Coleman and. Uh, what are some of the topics? For speculation, I'd say yes, sir, they actually are. have a list of topics for uh, tonight that we might go over. Yeah. Um, yeah. yeah. Is uh, is bowling cool or lame? Uh, that's always a good one. Weirdest things you've eaten. This is one of my favorites. If you look down your scope in Iraq, so you're in war, and saw a pretty, a very pretty ISIS boy looking right at you. With his Kalashkin on muzzle between his luscious Arab lips. Finish him! I'm gonna save that for tonight. I I have several answers. I'm sure everyone has. Well, well, Joel, ones. let's uh, let's try some different topics that we'll save for. Who um? Who said that? I bet you Ian said that. Probably. He yeah, well, righteous, uh, but he's the most messed up. Yeah, I think Ian's our uh, our flawed knight in training armor. <laughs> he's a beautiful Nordic looking man. Like if he had long blonde hair, he would look like a big fat Viking. Oh, he's a beautiful boy. I really want to see boy. him. Uh, I want to see him eating more food and getting real strong. I want to see him <laughs> become the man I want him. <laughs> Just walk up to a fat person, Jules, when they're eating, and say, "Keep up the good work, son. I want to see you get nice." Well, and no. Strong. If you're fat, you should stop eating and become a fit, handsome man. No, I say like go up to him and confuse him. Dude, hurry up and. Beat Scorp who you oh! beat Scorpion already. Well, it's, I'm on endurance round two. Um, At least you're making somewhat progress. Endurance round three uh, is weird. Sometimes it will take me forever, and sometimes we get right past it. Huh. Well, that's real neat, Jules. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Starting strong. Everyone knows though, if they win the first match, they'll be easier on the second match. Just to make it fair, which I think that's a little messed up in my opinion. There should be a set difficulty. You know? I don't know, it makes the game interesting. Sonya oh, yeah. does. But, uh, you winning right there, Drew? Sonya! You, uh, <laughs> you were about to grab him and he grabbed you. Yeah. 
Oh, this is the episode where Jordy gets stuck in the lift. Uh -oh. He has sweat marks on the back of his back. Do you think Georgie's cool, Jules? Or do you think he's an interesting character? Or do you think he's cool? Finisher! Nice little sound effect there added. Yeah, Oh gee, I sure hope I can get to, 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 to my kids. <laughs> so Jules, uh, uh yeah. What Star I mean uh X X-Men comic are you gonna buy next? Uh, talk about some of your X-Men fetishes. Let's see here. This guy's a freak for X-Men. I do have X-Men fetishes. I have masturbated many times. Wolverine's Harry Cobb. Usually uh, parody things. I have done uh, one with Wolverine in it, and he did have a weird Harry Cobb. What would that. you do, Jules, if you woke up on the X-Men team? Like, let's say you wake up. Really start hanging out no, with No, 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 no. You're, you, you're, you're in the X-Men squad. The nightmare, it's a nightmare though, because they all act like they know your power and everything, but you don't know, you don't have a power. You know? Like, they're talking like, hey Jules, remember that mission last time? Yeah, you, you obliterated those guys, and you're just like, haha, yeah, man. They just go with you don't have a finish him. You don't have a power. Fuck! Break the, uh, break the steel. Uh, no! Damn, up, bro. I messed up. Sonya failed. Shit. I'm, I'm suing you. I'm sorry. <laughs> hey, at least you're on the third one, though. Yeah. Anyway, uh... Yes, what were we talking about? Um, you woke up on the X-Men team oh, yeah. and you didn't have a power and everyone... Uh, I wouldn't dead. care. I'd just immediately go, uh, and go to Nightcrawler and just Dude, have you got a wall of... You see how fast he beat that guy? Yeah, I said round three. So Sonya's a tough magical. lady. Oh, okay. Cage, Cage is gonna throw his green balls at you. <laughs> he tried to double grab him. I've done that a few times. It's, uh, it's a little treat. I'm looking forward to you playing as Luke Kang because you're gonna spam the fuck out of his flying. Well, <laughs> that's on the second game though. Yeah, we found out if you fly I over. Know, I don't know if it works on the first game. Oh yeah, that was the second one. Anyways, in the second game, Luke Kang, Jules would fly around at them, and uh, bots wouldn't know what to do. They'd just squat the whole time. So you'd fly back and forth super fast. So they'd just be squatting on. Stop not knowing what to do. It was pretty funny. I approve. Thank you. I approve too. Uh, anyway, uh, my next X Men comic will, uh, well, chronologically, I want to get a Apocalypse Saga, which is, uh, lost. explains Apocalypse's origin and all about him and all that whole thing. Yeah. But, uh, fortunately, it's around $80, and I'm waiting to find a better deal, uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and just get, uh, the continued adventures of, uh, Scott and Phoenix, which, uh, is, a, a time travel kind of thing. It mostly actually takes place in the 18th century. Yeah. Which is, uh, pretty neat. It's, uh, gotten good reviews. That's the next one I get. Yeah. And, uh, right now in my collection, I'm, uh, really done with Uncanny X-Men. Uh, which is one of my favorite series because it's uh, just really good chemistry between the team and all that. Oh, yeah. So, uh, you know, you got your Nightcrawler, your swashbuckling kind of guy. He, he'll he hang out with people. He's the guy you want to have a few beers with. He's your friend off the bat. And you got Wolverine. You know, the only time you want to hang around Wolverine is to drink a few beers and you don't really talk. Yeah. Um, which could be kind of cool, I guess. He's your creepy uncle. And uh, then you have uh, Charles Xavier. He's your creepy grandpa. He, uh, he he will go into your mind and do strange things. And I always felt like that's why I couldn't be the X-Men. is because you have some guy just fucking reading your mind 24-7. Hi, Toxic. He's new. Toxic? Hey, it's Toxic. Hey, don't touch me. You're Toxic. Woo! Yeah, the uh, strategy I'll usually use for Goro is just flying kicks. In fact, that's really good. No, Jules, I've seen some real, real players, real men, uh, fight them with normal tactics, not this cheap stuff, this communist crap. What real players have you seen? Huh? What real players have you seen besides? Real players? Uh, there's one guy named Donigan. Donigan? <laughs> Donigan Archer? No, um, Donigan fucking 
beat Goro just with his fist. He didn't jump once. You know who uh, did get a flawless on Goro? Japanese man? No. My girlfriend, Chanel Washington. I didn't know Chanel liked playing Mortal Kombat. She loves Mortal Kombat. Bullshit. She That's how we don't first like met. Mortal Kombat. We met, uh, we were going online. I was like, there's only one other person online on Mortal Kombat. The original Girls arcade, don't like, play Mortal Kombat. And I was like, who are you? What is your name? They she play was like, Street I'm Fighter. Chanel Washington. I said, cool, you want to go out? Because girls fight on the streets. Chanel, does she fight on the streets? Girls Jules, don't. bet she does. Yeah, she grew up in Detroit, man. <laughs> She's gonna fight on the streets. What's she doing here? I thought you told. Why she, she moved? Down no, here? she moved here. Uh, yeah, I, I know. I don't know why. I won't talk to her. I don't talk to Chanel about stuff like that. <laughs> I'm still not convinced you guys are in an actual relationship. We are in a relationship. We. Uh, it sounds pretty. We we have fake. sex all the time. Hot sex. And if you have sex, you, it means you are in a relationship. Bacon it's written. In, it's written in the Bible. Really? No. <laughs> I was about to say, I don't even remember Chanel reading the Bible. She doesn't. Well, oh, one time she showed up to a family reunion. She gets really religious. Yeah, that was weird. Yeah, I'm like, I was like, Chanel, get out of here. You, know, you, you only get here you when you get married, alright? No scram. That's never gonna happen. She was pretty cool. I don't think Chanel's the kind of lady who would want to get married. Uh, she wants, uh, she's actually in an open relationship. It's uh, driving me insane because she says, uh, I just can't satisfy her or something like that. You need to speak so up, she Jules. Just, uh, she just goes and... You need to talk like how I do. Project your voice like a man. Oh. Yeah, whatever. You know, Chanel. Oh, fuck. Fuck, speak up. fuck that, uh... Yes, uh, Scorpion and Sub-Zero are the best. I like Scorpion because it's always a treat to hear him say, Get over here! Over. Get down from there, like in the movie. Is someone asking questions about Scorpion? Do they even know who Scorpion is? Who's asking? Some... Huh? Yeah. One through three, the classics. Um, so, uh, ba bacon, bacon man. Uh, if, uh, he's, he said Scorpion and Sub Zero are the best. I'm agreeing with them. Yeah, they're uh, they're they are actually not overrated <laughs> because they're so uh, they're so important. Hey, Jules, imagine Scorpion had his pants down. He was bending over and spread his cheeks and said, "Get in here!" <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! Mortal Kombat parody porn. Why have I not watched that? Get I in here! I've been so preoccupied with X Men oh. and DBZ porn that I haven't even oh, focused man. on MK porn. Oh, jeez, I bet you exist. There's porn in Well, yeah, it exists. There's <laughs> some weird Sonya stuff. Hey, Jules, dude. who has a bigger wiener? Sub Zero Scorpion? They're same size, same guy. Yeah. Sorry to tell you guys. Piscina plays as both of them. Daniel Piscina plays Daniel as Scorpion. Piscina. No, no, you say Daniel Piscina, and I say Scorpion. Daniel Piscina. Who? Right. Yes. Anyway, uh, he plays Scorpion, Sub Zero, and Johnny Cage. Johnny Cage. What do you think about Johnny around? Cage, Jules? I mean, we know all the lore about him. He's a movie He's star. Asshole. He's an asshole. He carries a briefcase around and like a girl. I'm kind of uh, mad because he wins the thing, and I'm like, we didn't lose. I was about to ask you, Jules. Um, do you? I know in Mortal Kombat you have characters you love and you hate. Mm -hmm. um, are there any characters who you hated, but as you played through them, you started to like them? No, I still hate. I, hate, I still hate Johnny. I still don't really. Sonya is just that one person I just don't care about. Yeah. Because she was only put in here so they'd have a female character, I think. Like, I feel like they should have added in e e either just man or more females than just, like, one, you know? And her fatality is, just, is a kiss. That's, that's stupid. I'm starting to feel... What happens if, uh, like, what happens if, uh, Scorpion's fatality is he blew a little kiss? I don't, I don't, I don't give hilarious. a shit, Jules. Um, I'm getting really stressed out since Troy is pretty much the only female main lead character yeah, on Star Trek. I don't really like I'm Troy. starting to have feelings for her. I'm starting to imagine her big, big hairy, big hairy vagina because this is the 90s, 80s. I still don't like Troy. I don't like Finish her. She's the only thing to look at. That was nice. <laughs> thanks, thanks, Tyler PR. <laughs> Tyler PR. Uh, yeah. Goro's gonna break your back just like Bane did the Batman. Hey Jules, what do you think about the new Batman movies coming out? I don't care. Well, actually, I do. do That's care. one of the ones I'm uh, looking forward to. I'm gonna to. go in there with a clear conscience saying this is a Batman movie. That's all I'm gonna say to myself. I'm not gonna say it. Ben Affleck. I'm not gonna say. I'm not gonna say Christian Bale. Uh, I'm not gonna I'm not, say. I'm not gonna think Ooh. about Superman that they messed up and you know. Who's, who's directing it? Is it there? Uh, Steven Spielberg. George Lucas. <laughs> George Lucas. <laughs> I 
think I think Batman should be a hero. Uh, no, but uh, seriously, Tommy Wiseau is. Uh... <laughs> no, Tommy Wiseau doesn't even do that anymore. He's just a gold film actor now. <laughs> Almost said really. He did a good job. No, I, just kidding. That movie, fuck, the love scenes in that movie were so fucking awkward. And then the song actually skips a one love making scene, like when they're on the stairs. God cries every time they have sex. On that movie. It rains. Goro's actually a pretty cool character. No! He's an overpowered new! No, I'm he's saying the design. I'm saying the design. The guy who did the claymation did excellent. He's this job. asshole with the big little Speedo. I know! A little, a little red belt. I'm saying character design, not him, himself. See, I hate the fact that he does that little flex like, look at me, I'm stronger than a 90s mom. Character design, but not himself. Are you stronger than a 90s mom? Uh, no. <laughs> Is anyone stronger than a 90s mom? <laughs> no one. Okay, in the 90s, if your kid was trapped into a car, a mom would lift up that car. In 2000, they do, oh, uh, they take a picture of it with their phone and call the police. The Hulk, Jules. The Amazing Hulk. You wouldn't like me when I'm angry. Uh, yeah. Oh, it's incredible! Amazing Spider-Man. Oh, sorry, I was thinking You don't amazing, know! Wasn't well, it the Amazing Bolt? The Amazing Bolt. Yeah, I was yes. thinking of the Amazing Bolt. No, it's amazing. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's amazing Bolt because they couldn't pick guy. Incredible, so they so ripped Isn't off. Isn't there an awkward Amazing Bolt sex scene in that movie? There was this one scene where this lady's feeling his balls. Um, if that's what you're talking about. <laughs> is that considered sex, or is she just looking for a, or is she holding his balls, asking me to call? Well, that's all. Yeah, that's all Chanel Washington will do to me. She just cups my balls and <laughs> just cooes at them. <laughs> no, she <laughs> stares me in the eye angrily and cups <laughs> my balls. Does she squeeze occasionally? Like I could kill you right now. <laughs> Riff. No, <laughs> she just cups him and doesn't do anything. Is there? I think there is a phobia. That's all I got. Uh, I think it's called blowjob phobia. Uh, yeah, you're afraid of their, uh, the, it's not called blowjob phobia, but... I'm pretty sure it is, dude. <laughs> it's not a Tyler, type it's in like a... oral PR man! Type in, uh, type in, type in, type in blowjob Research phobia. boy, go! Damn it, I was so... I was so close! I know some... I know... I, I, I know it's a thing. I don't know what it's called, though, but guys are afraid to get... Uh, it's known as domophobia. Domophobia. Osophobia. Osophobia. Mm. I like domophobia better. Domophobia. Hey Joel. Yeah. What happens if you were uh, you you were you were uh, not gonna beat Goro? He's gonna kill you. You were banging a uh, you were banging some broad. Some, some broad some down broad. down at City Hall. Some broad on the west. Some broad on the west side. Yeah. And uh. So you so you put your put your penis inside of her here for JJ. For JJ. And you just feel this. Furry love inside of there. What would you do? I would go digging around there instantly. Say, found you. Pull out a little. No, rabbit. like, uh, like, re realistically though, I would pull out and it's be like, a magic what the fuck? Trick. The fuck's wrong? What the hell? What's wrong with you? Like, you know, I'd just be like, ah. I would, I would, I would uh, laugh like a little boy. I'd run away and jump cry. up and down. I never, I never giggle. do that again. I would giggle. <laughs> Tell her to do it again. <laughs> what would you do if? Uh, if you were like, uh, do it like if you were for some reason some Tinder guy or something, some thing, Tinder boy. Tinder meet up, yeah. You meet up, uh, you meet up with this girl. Up with some you know why you're there, you're just there to bang. Yeah. And, um, and she suddenly just starts showing you photos and videos of her childhood. <laughs> of her childhood? <laughs> yeah. Very like, coitus? Would... No, or... no, like right before she's like, oh yeah, before we do this, I wanna, I wanna let you know who I am. Well, that's what I, that's what I do to every girl I've ever made love with. No, but I really, say, this like... is a picture of my grandpa, this is my family portraits. <laughs> Um, yeah. I show her every, my family history books, my family tree, I show her my medical records, and then I'm like, alright, I am ready to mate with you now, and that's what I do. Uh, they usually leave before, but, you know, I can't Joel, what was that one thing? This was a long time ago, I don't know, when we were watching Power Rangers, we decided Watching that, Power Rangers as kids, or when we were full-grown men? Full-grown men. Okay. Um, we were watching Power Rangers, it says, uh... When I, it's like when I, yeah, the next time I'm gonna bang a girl, I'm gonna I'm gonna say, yeah! I'm like <laughs> do something weird. I hey, what's her name? I can't remember what's what the it was. Name? It's like Wah! her breath smells like shit or something. Like someone said, you got bad breath, lady, and she was like, Dah! she's like the Power Rangers. And, uh, we got oh yeah, we were gonna play that song in a on a boombox. Rita, 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 just like Vegeta. Yeah, Rita, and we were gonna we were gonna bang that like like we were, I was gonna like. Start playing that music and show her that scene and just. No, like, Jules. What you're gonna night. do is you're gonna. Hello, OMG, I am. Ah, oh, hey there, friends. 59. I like that 59 ad in there. It's it really neat. You know why I picked that? It's because someone else already picked Prince. <laughs> someone already. He was like, he wanted Prince 58, and he was forced to go with 59. He was like, fuck. <laughs> 
He almost gave up, but uh, he 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 uh, went around it. Just like uh, how I picked Baby Juelas. I picked. I I was. I was on. I was picking baby jewels to eat some enchiladas, and you're like, let's call it jewels, just like no, enchiladas. It was on this. Uh, I was on. It wasn't YouTube. It was like on this game or something. I was playing I picked baby Jew jewels, and that was already taken. So I said so, j j baby jewels. Hey, because um, I guess not enough people know the Spanish language. Fifty nine. He's a sex offender. Oh really? Wow, nice. Yeah. What you do, man? Tell us all about it. Tell us all about it. Tell us your tell us your stories. Oh, Data, you just got zapped. No! Is he okay? No, he's about to fall. Oh, we're caught him with this shit. Dude. I'm sorry, oh, yeah. 59. Warp. I can't talk about this. Big anymore. wiener, short stubby wiener. I say short stubby. Has all Klingons have big, uh, little short stubby, uh, you know, like pickle pickle jar wieners. No, I think his. Uh, I think. <laughs> I don't think it's as thick as a pickle jar. Oh yes. I think it's as thick as a water bottle. And it's about as long as a double A battery, hmm. and it uh, has a little horn at the end of it, at the tip, because uh, Klingon women they like pouring Damn it. Yeah. Well, it's gonna be your last time. Just kidding. Uh, but um, yeah. That's why I think about Works Wiener. Yeah, I'm still just fighting Goro here. He's a he's a jerk. I don't like him. Prince, does Warp have a big wiener or a small wiener? Go. I'm asking uh, the sex offender guy. Oh. If he thinks Worf has a big or small wiener. Lieutenant Worf, uh, does he know who Lieutenant Worf is? Worf is a Klingon. There you I go, that's all the information. <laughs> Somebody doesn't know what a Klingon or a Worf uh, is. If you don't know who Worf is, then, uh, or, yeah, or a Klingon at least, then I think you should leave this. Oh, Jules, we are, we, are, we are open to all kinds of people. Yeah. I don't know if most Star Do uh do minorities like Star Trek? Um, okay, every guy I know who said they like Star Trek was white. Because you only know white people because you're racist! Yes. No, but uh when I was working at the Goro dude, is OP. Uh he uh he's now he's an overpower new. How's just, how's uh, um Jules, you better beat him or, or fifty nine is gonna be judging you. Gonna judge Is he judge? I I challenge fifty nine to fight. Hey, sometime. you can't do that. We'll challenge fifty nine. will save your fight for later if you have the game. If you don't, then get it. It's a good game. But I better beat fifty nine. Dude, fifty nine's gonna kick your ass. Right. I'll I bet you fifty nine can beat Goro with his eyes closed and both hands tied behind his back. You just hit his hit the keyboard with his face to control the characters. Now for the real challenge off. Get him, Jules, duck! Oh, yeah, do it again! Oh, he blocked it. He's a sneaky sly. Dead. That's the finishing move. Oh, no. That's, That's the finishing move. Shane Zoom! <laughs> It'd be a real treat to see me defeat this, uh, defeat this game. USN guy, there <laughs> is a phobia. If your wiener's in someone's mouth, they could bite it clean off like a ribeye. Rip it off. So, uh... Better, better think twice before you Imagine if I, if I managed to do the leg grapple on Shane Tsung. That'd be a treat. I think that would be a treat if you're close enough to him. Yeah. Um, that'll never happen, though. Yeah, I guess so. Hey, Joel, talk about your uh, Princess Leia porn. That's a really good topic. Yeah, Alright, uh, I'm an old fashioned guy. I like uh, Princess Leia. She's hotter than any other Star Wars. Describe some of your uh, photos and stuff in the collection. I like uh, photos of her and. Just naked or in her sex outfit. I also like uh, photos of it with a big wiener. So well, funny. A lot of those. Yeah. Yeah. Well, there's not a lot out there. I have like the three princess. Now, do you do that because you find it funny, or does it actually turn you on to see? A little princess. bit of both. I'm like, yeah. I, I but only if uh, Princess Leia is kind of the dominant one. You know? Like if she has a, if she has a dick. Like I would hate to see Padme doing Princess Leia. Well, first of all, Padme that's, that's incest. Yeah, that is. <laughs> But, uh, you know, who cares? Yeah, who cares? This is America. So they're not, but it's not Go really because it's a fictional universe. It's a parody. Yeah. Yeah. If there's any, like, 
porn, uh, drawn porn of just like real people, but not like just considerably hot people, just like political officials and stuff. Like, I want to find some Obama. Oh, I'm sure. Oh, are you kidding me? I'm sure. There's well, sure yeah, there it is. But uh, I've never actually looked for it. Never looked for it. Yeah. I never, I never uh, looked up uh, Obama sex tape XXX by now. Hey yeah, Jules, so. I have a serious question for you. Uh, it's a yes or no answer. Uh, if you get sprayed up the butthole by a skunk, you turn into a skunk furry. Is it like Shit. a werewolf? What? No, you don't get sprayed. No! A fur furry is something you have from birth, man. No, I you, if, uh, you wake up and you're like, I, I like furry, fucking animals. I thought being a furry was contagious. Well, it's not even just really fucking animals. Um, yeah, Mason, Mason. Let's talk about our friend's personal got, got uh, sexual by a dragon. stuff. Huh? Let's talk about our friend's personal sex sexual fetishes. Sexual fetishes? Um, first of all, Tyler likes big black guys. Well, yeah, that's fact. but everyone does. <laughs> No, I, I don't like big fat black guys. Yeah, I'm not gay, like Tyler. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. He flipped us the bird. I'm just kidding, Tyler. Means I know that it's not true. I know you're a powerful rich sexual man. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he's, a, he's a powerful heterosexual man. Tyler. Um, Tyler P.I. What would you like to see in Decker Season 3, Jules? Decker Season 3? I don't care. If you guys don't do. know about Decker Season 3, uh, check it out. It doesn't exist, but look up Decker anyways. Look up Decker Season 2. Season 2. Hawaii Vacation. I'm wrong. Terrastron. Um, Jules, I have a pretty good conspiracy theory. Yeah. Okay. What happened if ISIS was hiding in Mexico? They're not. They could. They're not. They could camouflage them with the public. Ooh. Just mm. switch their turbans for sombreros. Yeah. Being a right right in our back door. Hmm. Dude, hurry up and beat Shane's ceiling already. It's uh it's working. I don't give a fuck. Uh you have to beat this game of Sonya one more time, right? This is it. You move on to Raiden after her. Yeah. Oh, he's gonna get you. Oh! Hey -ya! That was a nice little quick maneuver there. Yeah. That's pretty what cool. Oh! Huh. Oh! Huh. 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 So you what I'm cooking in my kitchen. Shoes, would you uh yeah. if Riker gave you the option of being a yes. chick with him, would you be Yes! A yes! A devil's three-way. I think it would be I don't know. Oh! Oh! I did it! Outstanding! So oh my god! I'm a big well, mommy! Okay, everyone uh, everyone watching the stream, you're about to become educated in Sonya's lore. I win! Um, everyone loves Sonya lore. Uh, it's probably the most. Captured by Shang Tsung, Sonya's special unit was taken hostage. Their only hope was the tournament. Shang Tsung promised to release the entire team. See the American flag behind her. Uh, not Russian. Either. Only if Sonya can win the contest, her victory not only released her unit, sure but the also viewers can read. To the right. Black Dragon, Chang Tsung's, I don't know about that, grip on the tournament. Oh, okay. That one guy thought you're supposed to put numbers in a name. Who does that? Let's read the credits. Okay. Daniel Pacina. Johnny Cage. Richard Devizio, who also plays Baraka in Mortal Kombat 2. Carlos Pacina. See? It is a uh, Mexican name. Ho Sung Pak. Luke Daniel Pacina. Scorpion. Daniel Pacina. You did this. Elizabeth Malachi. I wonder if she's, uh, she said she was an exotic dancer. No, she said she was a dancer, which, which means automatically exotic means dancer. she's, no one says they're a dancer. Yeah. Might you're, as well just say it, Sonia. You're, you're a ballerina. Wait, you're say his name. Oh, 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 John Jacarcirelli. Uh, <laughs> oh, Sung Pak. Oh, uh, he actually plays. Um, sure. so, the he guy actually plays Luke King. Oh, he's Luke King? Yeah, they play the same guy. More oh, so he doesn't design. look like a fucking weirdo then. Yeah, they just put shit on his face. Well, what a. Hey, classic. guys, uh, John Tobias. Remember that name. John Tobias? <laughs> Tobias for me is a dumb name. I don't know. Tobias? Tobias. I don't know. Uh, I think of a phony when I think about I think John Tobias is an amazing name. You know? 
No. Warren Davis and uh, Pat Cox. Cox. And Terry Medinick and Allison Gurd and George Petro and Petro. Petro. You wouldn't feel, uh, you wouldn't feel, like, pressured a man. or, 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 like, uh, you wouldn't be able to get hard with Riker there. You know, you wouldn't feel like, you know, it's like when you need to pee and a guy stands right next to you and stares at you, you can't pee. Yeah, you get shy. I have a, Would I have you get a shy from Riker, uh, Riker's manliness? Even like uh, when I was uh, when I was little, and there'd be like a whole bunch of people right outside the bathroom, like the door, and I'd be like, mm. or, or would Riker see that you're shy and you can't get it up, and he's like, he whispers to it and gives it a little a little slap. No, yeah, because... Riker Riker would help you along with it. All right, he guys, we're gonna take a ten you. minute break. Uh, gonna this is gonna be a good episode. Uh, Data wears a cowboy hat in this one, but we're gonna take a ten minute break. Real Too bad quick. you can't see that. Uh, are you gonna play as Raiden next, or are you gonna do a refresher? refresher Raiden? Course? Uh, well, let's see here. I would uh probably do a refresher course. No, nobody gives a fuck. Uh, ten minute break. Woo! Bye bye. Bye bye. Be back. Be out of be. Yeah.